guys welcome to my blog so today's project is to make rose water at home uh, we have a lot of rose uh, roses in our garden and we wanted to make use of them uh, so i thought of using uh, them to make rose water so let me explain you the uses of rose water so rose water has a lot of vitamins like a b3 c and e and you can use it as a toner and apply it on your face in the morning after shower or night before going to bed on a clean face it soothes the skin irritation you can also mix it with your face pack and apply it on your face or you can also use it on hair as a spray hair spray it restores the natural shine of your hair and there are a lot many uses of it these are just few of them so let's start the process i collected these rose petals from different rose plants if you have a rose plant that has a good aroma that is perfect for making this rose water so these are all the different colorful petals i have right now so let's first wash these petals to make sure we clean off any dust or insects from these petals um yeah so i'm just washing them and then i later i take a clean plate squeeze off all the excess water from the petals and uh, i place them on that clean plate i have it all ready here right now so let's start making the rose water now so i first take a clean dish uh, and then i put like two cups of water in it and after the water is boiled for 5 minutes i add the clean rose petals to it so we have to add all the petals and uh, yeah once all the petals are added uh, you don't have to take a bigger dish because uh, once this rose water boils these petals shrink in size and uh, they should reduce in volume so this dish should be good enough Yes. So after I'm done adding all the petals, I am making sure that I have put enough water for all these petals to cook. Uh I'm just slightly dipping these petals in the water so they can cook evenly uh before I close it with a lid. So I keep stirring these petals occasionally in between just to make sure that they are evenly cooked. uh and just to make sure that there is enough water um, yeah so we just have to cook it with a closed lid so this is how the petals turn out after boiling in the water they start fading the color and all that color is now slowly used into the water and if you notice the color of the water it is kind of red or pink based on the color of petals that you used um this looks amazing right so yeah you just have to keep cooking it slowly on a slow to medium flame and you can start looking at the magic so once you are done with cooking uh you can filter uh the water and the petals either you can squeeze it with your hand or you can use a strainer uh to separate the petals and the water so uh, this is how the water looks the color is amazing right so when i made it for the first time i was really impressed with the color so after the water cools down uh you can use any bottle like i try to reuse some bottles i have uh you can just fill that with the rose water and you can keep it in the refrigerator this should stay good for at least uh 3 to 4 months uh i usually use it before that this is how you make the rose water hope you enjoyed this video uh if you liked it please share and subscribe thank you